Alright people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Thursday, and that means that we are using Burning Abyss. So, yeah. Burning Abyss. Where did you go? Where did you go, Burning Abyss? You kind of just fell off. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. You you just kind of disappeared. You know? And it's understandable because uh, there's one key thing that makes you know the top decks the top decks, and that's consistency. And Burning Abyss, not early, you know? But, you know when you're going against that, you know... Uh, you're going against like necros who can like pretty much make their hand, create their hand, and you, you're going against like satellas who, you know, continuously build up resources. You got Burning Abyss here, and they're just kind of like, nah, you know, like really, you know, like look at this hand, look at this hand, it's not the best hand in the world, definitely not, definitely not the best hand in the world. I'm going against your Senjus. Let's go ahead and see how that goes down. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and make a Dante play. Just kind of sucks that, uh, I ended up, up too fantastically. Actually, you know what? I'm not. I'm not. I'm gonna special summon Cal Cab. Yeah, special summon Cal Cab, and then normal summon Scarm. Oh, well, or my opponent can have the fucking Vanity's emptiness. All right. Well, I guess thank you for that. I guess. That sucks. Uh, this is gonna be a difficult duel, isn't it? I should have summoned you in attack mode, actually, now I think about it. So this should be fun. So fucking Vanity's Emptiness for its turn. I could get him right now. Yeah, I'm gonna crush card his ass. Alright, number generator decided to give me crush card, so fuck your vanities. Okay, I guess. Get rid of you and you. Oh, you're only four. Oh, you're only a thousand. Okay, well, there goes your vanities. Now I know everything that she has. So you're in a, you're in deep shit now. You're definitely in deep shit now. Because there goes your vanities. I know your two monsters in your hand. You have to send you training ground. Oh, you actually want to send. I know, I know what you got now. Yeah, you're gonna lose. You're gonna lose because I'm gonna go ahead and search tour guide. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and search tour guide. So I actually edited the deck and I'm actually trying out some, uh, some of the new cards that have been played in Burning Abyss as of late. I'm gonna go ahead and try them out. So we're gonna go ahead and summon tour guide. Yep, you're fucked. You're so fucked. Oh my god, you're fucked. Uh, tour guide summon graph. Yeah, graph. You're so fucked. So fucking fucked. Oh my god. I, I'm gonna have you pinned down. A crush card. You just had to play the MST, didn't you? You're like, I gotta play the MST. Like, is it really necessary? And we'll go ahead and mill three, because I'm planning on running him over anyway. One, two, three. I like to use graph, yes. We'll go ahead and summon. I'm not. I haven't milled any of the the new cards that I wanted to go ahead and try out. Did I mill two graphs? Yeah, I did. And a, wow, Divine Wrath Graph, Divine Wrath Graph, Divine Wrath Graph, like, wow. Oh, there goes all my fucking Divine Wraths and Graphs. At least I can summon Graph back with Sir if I ever want to. So you can go away. You can get punched in the face. Can I not do any damage to you this turn or something? Hmm. Is there something that I activated so he can take any damage? Huh, I don't know. I have no idea. Anyways, you're screwed. So screwed. So screwed. I have another Fire Lake, so you're gonna get Fire Lake. As soon as you summon your fucking... They send you. Yup. Fucking Fire Lake your ass. Melt. Melt, motherfucker, melt! Surprise, motherfucker! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so it really doesn't matter who you summon. You go ahead and get me back Fire Lake. Because I have a Burning Abyss in my hand, so I can just summon my Burning Abyss with a Dante on the field and fuck you up again! <laughs> like, yep. 
I'm running, I'm running like a Back Jack or Jack Black or whatever his name is. Go ahead and give my tuning guide back. Black Jack. <laughs> Jack. You guys didn't know I'm fucking running fucking Jack Black, guys. You, you guys didn't know. Come on, everybody. Everybody, you should be running Jack Black in your deck. He's he's a he's a great actor. And dare. <laughs> uh, what's his name? Fucking something. I forgot his name. Absolute Absolute King Back Jack. I think that's his name. I want to say. I think I'm. I think I'm right on that. Uh. I'm gonna fire like you anyway, so it really doesn't matter. I said I can I can fire like you over and over and over and over and over and over. Yeah. So I can fire like you again, and then Dante will grab me back my fire. Like I had the tour guide again, so I can fire like you again. Like this duel is pretty much over. I can pretty much fire like you repetitively. <laughs> That's it. I'm not. I, I, I might not be topping as much, but burning abyss. But I'm not lower than you send you. Definitely know that. Definitely know that for sure. I'll tell you what. But yeah, this deck is just kind of inconsistent, to say the least. Okay. Well, I didn't get to go ahead and activate my fire lake, but it's fine. I can activate it now. Blow you up again. Just go away. Farfa, go away. Dante, you're my fire lake. <laughs> I'm gonna have, I'm in complete control of this duel. Like, you go away to the end phase. And then when you summon back, I'm gonna kill you. Like, yeah, just surrender. I got you locked down. I beat that ass. Woo! All right, let's get another duel in. Bear back. All right. Uh, you too, I guess. Like I said, I'm using Burning Abyss, so. Yeah. Sand's not the greatest. Definitely not. So, what do you do? I can bounce a set card. What do you do? Same thing. And then you can summon a Burning Abyss from the graveyard? Uh, I guess I can go into a Dante. So, split. Special summon you. Or normal summon you. I don't know who I want to summon. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna a little bit, so I'm not gonna use you. So I'm gonna use you. So, so you're gonna be the one to get milled, and I'm not even gonna get your effect anyway, so it doesn't even matter. So we'll go ahead and just summon Cal Cab. Uh, you know what? Maybe I'll hold on to you. Yeah, I'll hold on to you. Hmm. Nah, nah, nah. I'd rather have you as an XC material right now. Go ahead and go into Dante. See? Yeah. It's hard to get the ball rolling with this deck. It's inconsistent, it mills. It's just not the best of decks. I must definitely say not. One, two, three. Huh? Oh, well, I milled the Sir, even though I did that with Sir, so. I guess I'll go ahead and summon. Well, it doesn't matter who I send back. Summon back. It wasn't the best of mills, but it wasn't the worst of mills either. You know? I got something from a mass train second, so if I want to do that, play. What do you say if my opponent adds cards to their hand? That, how do, what do you say? What do you say specifically? Most of the time, if your opponent adds cards from their deck to their hand, except during the draw phase. Or during the demo step, you can banish one random card in your opponent's hand. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and activate that. Pitch you, turn you into a Dark Law because Chen resolves backwards, so I'll have Dark Law in the field. I don't know why I'm running three Dark Law. The extra deck was just like fine, so I was like, you know what, sure, whatever. Yep, give me something. Give me that Rado. Damn, snatch that Rado right out of his hand. I bet he went to play that too. Damn. Damn. <laughs> I was like, give me that rudder. <laughs> now he's going on the defensive. I don't blame you, sir. I don't blame you. Alright. Detach you. Go ahead and mill three. One, two, three. Uh, sir. Sure. 
Farfa, sure. Sir, go ahead and summon me back Cow Cap. Farfa banishes monster to the end phase. Phase down. Sure. I forgot I had Dark Wall on the field, which is fine. I can just go ahead and put something back in his hand. But let me shave off a nice chunk of your life points. Unless you had, unless the, I bounced the wrong one and you had Mirror Force, all of a sudden you're like, ah, oh, damn, bounced the wrong one. <laughs> uh, I could go ahead and XC with you to Downright Magician. Yeah, you know, I'll go ahead and do that. I'm, I rarely use Downright Magician, so it's fine. Go ahead. Uh, your monster returns. So I wonder if that one back row that I spun with Calcab was actually something to stop me. No idea. I kind of like Calcab. You know, it opens up the floodgates. I get rid of that back row for a second. Oh. Mmm. Ah, I'm gonna boundless that. I'm boundless him before you can uh do your play. Because if I get rid of him, he's not in your graveyard, so you can't even summon him. And then, you know, if I wait until you exceed, you'll have lead blow. And then if I bottom with that, you'll just block from destruction and get stronger. So, I think I'm smart. Smart. Not the dumbest Yu-Gi-Oh player in the world. I am low on resources, though. You know, shit hits the fan. That would suck. I am not milling any of my fucking new cards that I'm running. I'm not, I haven't got any of Jack Blacks. I haven't got, ooh, the new Bounty Bounty. Okay. You have Spar. Alright. Okay, conduct your battle phase. Oh, you're gonna go into 101. Oh. No, seriously, I thought you were gonna go into, uh, Lead Blow. Or oh, Lead Yoke, or whatever his name is. Lead Blow job. I seriously thought you were gonna go into that. Alright, this card attack is going to be Okay, okay. This card attack is going to attack after damage calculation on attacking C material. Alright, so I'll drop down to his attack, which is fine. I'm going to summon Crane, 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 summon Sir. Yeah, that seems fine. I still like Crane, Crane. I said, I'm just not milling any of my, uh, New cards. Like, none at all. It's interesting that you went to 101. And a turntle? Bottomless. Let's say you, you must also have bottomless. I didn't really get anything on the crane crane. Oh. There's no point in milling and getting rid of Sir because any running this monster I summon will die anyway. I can do the I can do the cow cap thing again. One, two, three. Sir, yes. Cow cab, yes. Farfa, yes. So sir, it doesn't matter. Actually, now now it doesn't matter who you summon because I've already used all their effects anyway. So and you're gonna die anyway, so it doesn't matter. I should have this game. You put that back in the hand once again. And Farfa banished that to the end phase, so unless this is something to stop me, I win. You're gonna die anyway, so it doesn't matter, because I'm not building this on the field. See, it's a little luck based. This deck is really, really luck based. That's Dante? Sure, I would love to get Dante's effect to go ahead and add me a burning this from my deck back to, I mean, from my graveyard back to my hand. I add that back, and game. Alright, well. It's another victory for Brendan Gibbs. Inconsistent, but I've been getting luck in my plays. Yet I have not seen any of my new cards. Ridiculous. All right, be right back. All right, back. This will probably be the last duel since I, of course, had to do an additional video. You know, along with Vitamin Y and Daily Duels, of course, we have the Telethon. So, still got a lot more to record. So, you know, 15 to 20 minutes, I think, is totally fine. Oh, finally, some new cards. All right. So here is Absolute King Bat Jack. So uh, once returning my opponent's turn, I can excavate, you know, 
the top card of my deck. Of course, the Burning Abyss monster I can deflect, and if it's a, if it's a, it's like a normal trap card. Yeah, it's a normal trap card. I can set it, and then it can be activated that turn. And if it's sent to a graveyard, I can look at the top three cards of my deck and place them in any order. So, and I can activate one. And then this guy, this guy. This is Pero Pero Cerberus. Uh, if I take any battle damage by a or battle damage or by a card effect while this card is in the graveyard, I can banish it and a target card and still destroy it. So pretty much the gist of it is I mill it, then my opponent does damage to me, and I go ahead and pop their shit. So these are the cards I wanted to go ahead and uh, try out. So uh, you know, there's no no. I'm gonna take this little slide and open up that well once again. Like I said, you know, two guys going down to one actually did hurt because it lowered the deck's consistency of opening plays definitely. So I'll just go ahead and set Pedro Pedro. He has 18 booty. There's nothing to complain about that. No complaints about that. So I wanted to go ahead and try these cards out. I, I saw a Burning Best deck top, like really the only recent Burning Best deck at top running this. And I saw a Burning Best play play this. And I was like, oh, that's interesting. I didn't even know that was really a card. So let me go ahead and try that out. So as you can clearly see, we're going up against some kind of synchro deck. So let's see how ham he goes first turn. <gasps> Pitch special summon. Okay. Okay, you can go into like a junk archer or. Oh, you're gonna summon back your jet synchron. Okay. And synchron carrier, summon that. But you know that as soon as you uh, synchro summon using this, you won't get the search, right? Hmm, okay. Probably should have set that vanities, but it's okay for right now. Just wondering, is I'm going to Junk Archer? Right? No, Nitro. Ooh, okay. Did not say Nitro where you're coming. Isn't, isn't Junk Archer uh, level 7? I would have went into Junk Archer and just banished my shit and then hit me all directly. That's what I would have done. And so I'm not going to tell you how to play Yu Gi Oh! Alright. Nice formula. Draw a card. Hey, you got first turn Quasar? You get that first turn, Quasar? I don't think so. No, I just kill my monster. Pedo! 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 Pedo in black. <laughs> so this is this is Pedo. See? Alright, this is Pedo, and this is uh, Jack Black. <laughs> Pedo and Jack Black. Uh, I'm so funny. And by funny, I mean absolutely not funny at all. <laughs> well, all I need is a Burning Abyss monster, and I'll be able to go into a Dante, which is what I want to go into right now. Hmm, Synchro deck with Back Row. Interesting. Usually ain't nobody got time for that. Wow. And I banished my Pedo. I banished my Pedo. <laughs> Uh, that's fine. So, let's go ahead and do this play. Like I said, is a Royal Decree or a Misty? I said, I seriously doubt that. Oh, maybe it is some back row. Okay, Synchro Deck runs back row. Interesting. Alright, so maybe you can do this turn, Mr. Synchro Guy. So the reason why I set the far face to go ahead and banish anything that he summons is stronger. Alright, that's fine. Top deck to MST, that's fine. Totally fine. I was gonna get him MST anyway. Eventually, so. It's totally fine. Uh to banish anything that he summons till the end of the turn, and then next time I can go ahead and summon it back with Crane Crane, and then go into like a Dante, and then start milling. That's it, see? It's hard to set up my opening plays. Not as strong as you know, the other top decks, even Shadal's, you know, especially with their star setups now. Just, there's a lot of stronger opening plays now.
that pretty much my deck can't handle. This deck cannot handle opening play-wise. I'm kind of just sitting here waiting for my opponent to do something. I feel I feel really passive right now. I feel like I'm playing Yang Zings. Just sitting here waiting like, hey, do something. Kill my monsters. Ooh. Ripped that soul charge. Alright, so. That sucks. It really does suck. Now he can't attack. Wow, he's gonna summon them all back. This door I'm being a little bit too passive. It's gonna be really difficult for me to come back to this. I really I really need to draw into a uh into a burning abyss monster. Like most definitely. Uh, if push comes to shove, I can always flip some of the Firefly, he'll go, and then I can summon it back with Craig and go into a Dante detach. Hopefully, mail like, you know, Sir or Graf or someone to go ahead and summon it, and I can fire a lake. No, because then they would die, because my face down monster. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, I'm in the conundrum. Definitely in conundrum. I'm in the road, road warrior. Alright, well you're gonna get your token, so... No road warrior effect. You can always sync the tokens with your formula synchron though. And then get road warrior effect. Do you have Quasar right now? Mm-hmm. to level 3. It's fine, but you can only synchro summon this turn, so you can't use a Red Warrior. And these two can become like a Leo, right? Oh no, they could be a Stardust Warrior. Yep. Oh my goodness, oh my damn. Wow, alright. Well, this is awesome. <laughs> This is awesome to say the least. So these two are gonna fuck me up next turn. And this can stop inherent summons, right? Yep. Yep. I can get me with the inherent summons. I have no idea what I can do this turn. You flip summon you, you banish you. Summon crane crane, crane crane, summon back to Farfa. Xe into Dante. Detach, hopefully mill something. Like, I'm in deep shit right now. I'm in deep shit. I'm gonna lose to a fucking synchro deck because I'm so inconsistent that I didn't draw into the cards that I needed. Oh wow, it says leaves the field, wow. Wow. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> that's just that's just dandy. Go ahead and mill the crane, detach and mill off the crane crane. Oh, those are pretty good mills. Let's say. Even though whoever I summon with Sir will immediately die. Scarn's gonna die, Sir's gonna die. I mean, Farfa's gonna die. Oh, there's no point. And I guess I'll just go ahead and try to kill the... I hate you, Blackjack. I hate you so much. I should have. I should have went after him with Blackjack first. Yep. Should have went after him with Black Blackjack first. Yep. 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 Ah, fuck. I said I should have just took the damage on the chin and had Blackjack go ahead and ram into his monster. And took the damage just so I could. And then, no, no, that wouldn't work either. Ah, fuck. God damn, I'm in a conundrum. Pretty much, I have to have him kill my blackjack. 
If she doesn't kill my blackjack, I can't do any of my real plays. Ah, uh, see, and this is why I hate running non-burning abyss shit. So. I'm fucked. <laughs> I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked. This is, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. He he got broke charge. He got fucking broke charge. There's nothing to say about that. You have to go into synchro plays he shouldn't have been able to do because broke charge. Foolish too. And damn, number generator. Calm the fuck down, number generator. You're gonna try to make me fucking lose with burning bits. Like, hello? God, I'm probably gonna lose this duel. I cannot think of a way to get out of this situation. If only he didn't, if only I, st I still have my Farfa. Because the fire, like, I can't scratch the summoning of my burning abyss monsters. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Am I seriously gonna lose to a synchro deck because I'm so inconsistent and he top decked the soul charge? Wow. Yep, the downfall of burning abyss. Yep. Eat a level off, then have him summon your uh, unknown synchron. Synchro summon. Yep. Wow. Wow, my pony here is top decking fucking top deck god. Like, he's inconsistent too. I'm like, ah, come on. It's not fair. Am I seriously gonna lose to a fucking synchro deck? I better not. Fucking fuck you, Blackjack. I don't like you. <laughs> Back. Your fucking Blackjack does not have my back right now. Oh, right. He can summon Jet Synchron. And then synchro summon with it, and then draw, and then fucking draw a card and search. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking lose. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking lose. Oh my god. Wow. You just keep on top decking into fucking cards at one to get off some bro busted ass plays. Some fucking bu 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 busted ass plays. Like, holy shit. And this is gonna fuck me up too. Oh, you had the level eater. Never mind. So you didn't even need that foolish. Soul Charge though, that Soul Charge play was just so fucking good. Summon another one. Oh no, summon fucking Colossalus, alright. Fuck you, fuck you and your ritual version too. Okay, I guess. So that doesn't change anything, my effect results in the graveyard, so. Look at this. Look at this, look at this. Hello, look at this. Look at this. Well, our Mades isn't strong enough to get over my booty, so. Could go for maybe and kill this, though. Librarian. I think you should have went to Librarian a little bit earlier in the duel than now. There's no fucking way. It's because of him. If he was not on the field, I can handle this. But with him on the field, stopping all my inherent sons, as soon as I go into an XC, he can just tribute himself. Yes. Yes. Uh, doesn't matter. Finish that until the end phase, please. Actually, you know what? Shouldn't have done that. Cause then he can go ahead and get the start to your effect again. Actually, I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure if I miss his timing or not. 
Ah, this is the fact. Select the order. Uh, how'd it go? First, second, third? It doesn't matter. I'm about to get fucked up anyway. It does not matter. <laughs> God, I'm fucked. I'm so fucked. So fucked. Because of him. If it wasn't for him. Okay, well, at least I got the order right. So if I can go special summon, you know, do all them shits. Nope, I'm fucked. I'm fuckity fucked fucked. Oh, well, can't blame a guy for trying, right? If I could just get this fucking fucking fire lake off, I would be totally fine. So as soon as I XC, I'm gonna get fucked. Star Sawyer? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, so fucked. Ah, oh, so fucked. Ah, oh, so fucked. Ah. <laughs> oh. Alright, give me far from back. If only this fire like wasn't here. If only I had it in my hand right now. I could something. If only Cal Cap go off right now. I might be able to pull something off. I might be able to pull something out of my hat right now. This is gonna be a risky play, guys. This is gonna be a risky one. I think I might have something. I think I might have something, guys. Oh, I already activated your effect this time. I think I might have something. Hold up, people. Hold up, people. Hold up, people. Don't give up on- go- don't give up hope! Don't stop believing! Go ahead and activate this. Go ahead and give me you back. Don't stop believing, people. Okay, so he's gonna come back, and then I can fire like his ass next turn. Oh my god, I can wreck his fucking shit. Uh, I already summoned you. Sure, I'll go ahead and summon you. Like I said, it doesn't matter, because I'm not planning on doing anything else with you guys anyway. If I come back into this duel, you guys owe me fucking, like, ten cookies. <laughs> Make it think I'm going on the defensive, but really, I'm actually going on the offensive. Yep, go ahead and come back, Mr. Starter Sawyer. Actually, I'm not even sure if he has any more level 8 or lower warrior synchro monsters, because he already has him, and he already summoned uh, junk, synchro junk warrior, so... I'm sure. Don't stop believing! No, but I would like to activate Fire Lake. If it's not too much trouble. If it's not too much trouble, I would like to activate Fire Lake. Before he goes into a play that I don't want him to go into. How's that sound? How's that sound? I think that sounds like a pretty good idea. How about that? Okay, now I can Fire Lake. Awesome. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and Fire Lake his ass. And I'm gonna get rid of... You can synchro summon. I don't want you to synchro summon. So I might kill you. Kill you. Uh, kill you. Definitely you. 
and probably you. I'm not really worried about you two right now. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna get rid of you and you. I'm gonna get rid of you, you, and you. Can I come back into this duel, guys? Can I come back into this duel? Oh! 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 <laughs> okay. I quit. I fucking quit. I fucking quit. Are you fucking shitting me right now? Ah! Fuck it. Are you fucking black jack? Fucking Oh my god. Fuck my ass. <laughs> This fucking Starlight Road. Just fucking put a bullet in my head. Like, wow. Wow. Of course it's fucking Starlight Road. Of course it's fucking Starlight Road. I, I surrender. Wow. Ah! I thought I had it with no Starlight Road. Like, fuck. Who the fuck plays that shit? No one. But apparently you do. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck you. Cerberus, you were pretty good, but fuck you. Fuck you, Blackjack. Blackjack, fuck you. You're a terrible actor, and I don't like none of your movies. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, God. Pedo, Pedo, you can stay. I'll probably keep Pedo in, because Pedo, Pedo put in that work. But Blackjack, no. You're done. You're fired. You're fired. You're not even that good. I don't even get why you, I don't even get it. I don't even get it. I tried it, and I don't get it. So I'm going to call it an episode of Daily Duels to come out as beat by Synchro Deck using Branding Abyss, because this deck is so inconsistent and unstable. There's, there's a reason why it's not the top deck anymore. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I had it. Why'd you have that Starlight Road? Ah, uh, fuck. Uh, I still was in a conundrum, but at least I was in a better situation. I was on a set with Sir. I was going to summon back to Dante. Then he's going to kill the Dante, and I was going to grab me back a fire late. You know, I could have came back to this duel. Activate the Dark Eruption. Go ahead and give my tour guide back. Tour guide summon. Make a f and set up the fire lake play again. Like, ugh. I would have had it. Ah. <laughs> So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow using the 2.5 Axis Fire Fist. Alright people, thanks for watching.